Jet guitars, Fazley guitars. Have you ever wondered what's the difference? Let's see if we can find out. Last year I bought four Jet guitars. A Jet JT300, a T-Type. A Jet JS300, a Jet JS400 and a Jet JS450. And this year I got three Fazley Finica guitars. After sharing my highly positive experience with these guitars, a few of my friends bought their own and kindly allowed me to review some of theirs. You know who you are, thank you guys. My work bought a couple of Fazley Finicas too, so I've had my hands on a fair few of these and I feel like I know the products quite well. I had big plans of making a series of videos on Jet and Fazley guitars, doing reviews and comparisons etc, before posting this big reveal expose video. I did make the review part of the series by the way, so you can check that up there, reviewing like all these guitars. But it might be a bit pointless now as Fazley have since discontinued their Finica line of guitars, which, spoiler alert, is the exact same as quite a few of the Jet models. But I have heard a rumour via Johnny at the Budget Guitar Show that there are a few new Fazley models in the works, so I'll be keeping an eye on his channel for that, and I'll put a link in the description so you can too. But in the meantime, here's some of the story so far. Last year, just before I was about to buy the Jet JS400, I discovered Fazley Guitars, which is the house brand of Bax Music. Just think of it like Harley Benton and Toman. Specifically, I discovered the Fazley Finica FSST 720. This guy here, and here, and here. I kind of like that one. Which looked almost identical to the Jet JS400 from their spec sheets and product images. So what is the difference? Well, I did a bit of forum digging and I found that some people were saying that they were made by Jet under the Fazley name for Bax Music or something like that. In fact, here is some of the things I read. Those are made and developed by Jet with some differences as their customer service confirmed. Fazley rebrand. Same thing apart from the headstock shape and the satin neck slash board finish. Fazley Finica was developed by Jet, but I think they stopped now. But this just seemed to be speculative forum lore. I scoured YouTube looking to see if anyone had did a review on both or a head-to-head -head comparison, with no luck unfortunately. And this basically became the catalyst for starting this channel. I had to find out. So I bought both. I was looking for a white strap. Not a vintage white, or a cream, or a blonde. And the Jet JS400 product pictures make it look really white compared to the Fazley Finica FSST 720. I decided to buy both and keep whichever one was the whitest. I have a bit of a history with Jet guitars and their product images colours being way off, but more on that later, in the part 2 video. I managed to snag a great deal on this Fazley Finica FSST 720 for £91 and I ordered the equivalent Jet JS400 for £160. They both arrived within a couple of days of each other, and lo and behold, they're the exact same guitars. Almost. Except for the headstock shape, the branding, and the branding on the back of the tuners. Everything else is identical, including the shade of white, unfortunately. Which wasn't as white as I was hoping for. I didn't know I was going to start a YouTube channel at this point, so unfortunately I didn't take any videos, but I did take some pictures. And I'll put them up now. You can see here, they're the same. The shades of white look a little bit off between the two, but trust me, it's just the lighting. I swapped sides and you can see that they are the same. All the specs are the same, the neck heel carves, necks, pickups, pick guards, everything. All the same. Anyway, even though I much prefer the Jet headstock shape, I didn't think it was worth the extra £70, so I returned the Jet and I kept this Fazley Finica here, and I love this thing. It's fantastic. If you're looking for an inexpensive strut shaped object, packed full of features, a great platform for modding, for next to nothing, you deserve a Fazley Finica. You've been good, go buy one now. Well, if you can. There's not a lot left, they're about to be discontinued. Last time I checked there was a dozen or so left and they were at about £85, so still a really good deal. And the prices could even come down more. I've seen them as low as 86, 76, 66 and even £56. You can check a review on that up there. When I seen the prices get that low, I couldn't help it and I accidentally bought another two. So, still needing to get to the bottom of this, I eventually contacted both Jet Guitars and Fazley Guitars for comment. I probably should have did that in the first place. I told them what I'd read in forums and my experience with both guitars, 
and mentioned I'd be doing some videos for YouTube. Unfortunately, Jet didn't respond, but Bax did, and here's what they said. Dear Steve, thank you for your email. First of all, we're glad to hear you're enjoying the Fazley guitars. We put in a lot of effort to make these the best value for money we could possibly offer. The Finica, Sunset and Outlaw series are the best examples of this. Then they quoted a question from my email to them. I have read on forums that some Fazley Finicas are made by Jet Guitars for Backshop.com. Is this true? Back said. We read this as well. It's fun to see people speculate about our products. The short answer is no. However, they are made in the same factory by the same team of people, so I guess the truth lies somewhere in the middle. Fazley will be releasing quite a few awesome new models this year, so definitely look forward to these. We will have some prototypes available during our Open Door event on May 27th. Kind regards, Bax Music People. I thought it was really cool for Bax to respond so quickly and openly, but not so cool for Jet to not respond. Hmm. I then noticed some other similarities across both brands' product lines and realised that a Jet GS400 is a Fazley Finica FSST 720. A Jet GS450 is a Fazley Finica FSST 820. These are now all gone, unfortunately, with being discontinued, except for maybe a few B stocks you might still be able to find. A Jet GS500 is a Fazley Finica FSST 920. Both brands' comparative guitars are exactly the same, except for the branding, as previously mentioned. Weirdly, if you check out these pictures here, you can also find Fazley guitars with headstocks more like Jets, and you can find Jet guitars with headstocks more like Fazleys. Or Sir. Slightly confusing stuff, I think. Now here's some tones. Clean and dirty, going through the Line 6 HX Stomp XL. The cleans are with a Fender Twin Style Amp with a touch of reverb, and the dirty channel is two stacked overdrives, a TS9 type and an OCD type, with the same reverb applied as on the clean tone. Enjoy! <laughs> So which one is better? Well, if you've been paying attention, I've just told you, they're both exactly the same. Ah oh dear. One big difference is that jets are around 60% more expensive, but you might want to fact check my maths on that, because it's definitely not my strong point. As mentioned previously, I do prefer the headstock shape of the jets, but for the price, the Fazleys can't be beat, and that includes against Harley Bentons, of which I've had three. They're just different. What I will say is, as far as the companies go, I now much more prefer Bax slash Fazley compared to Jet, for several reasons which you can find out about in this next video. I'll see you there.